Hi everyone, Ryan from Foxtech here. Today, I'm going to show you how to access saved YouTube videos on your iPad. Unlike some other social media platforms, saving videos on YouTube works a bit differently, and I'm going to walk you through how it's done and where you can find those videos later. When you save a video on Instagram, for example, it's pretty straightforward. You just click on the bookmark icon, and then you can easily access all your saved videos by going to your profile and tapping on that same bookmark icon again. However, on YouTube, things work a little differently. When you want to save a video on YouTube, you'll notice there's also a save button, which is represented by a bookmark icon. But instead of simply storing the video in a general saved section, YouTube prompts you to add the video to a playlist. So, essentially, you're organizing your saved videos into playlists that you can access later. After you click that save button, you'll need to either add the video to an existing playlist or create a new one. The good news is that these playlists don't have to be public. You can create private playlists just for yourself. This way, you can organize your saved videos however you like without sharing them with anyone else. To access these saved videos later, you'll need to head to your profile section on YouTube. On the iPad, you'll find your profile icon in the bottom right corner of the screen. Once you're in your profile, locate the Playlists section. This is where all your playlists are stored, including the ones where you saved your videos. If you remember which playlist you saved a particular video to, you can simply open that playlist and find the video there. But if you don't recall where you saved it, you might need to browse through your playlist to find the video. It might take a bit more time, but all your saved videos will be in there somewhere. Another great feature on YouTube is the Watch Later section. This is essentially a dedicated playlist specifically for bookmarking videos you want to come back to. It's a convenient option if you don't want to create multiple playlists and just need a quick place to save videos for later viewing. Many people find the Watch Later section to be the easiest and most organized way to manage their saved content on YouTube. So, that's how you can save and access your YouTube videos on an iPad. It's all about using playlists to keep track of your favorite content. I hope this guide has been helpful for you. If you found this video useful, please give it a thumbs up and consider subscribing to our channel for more tech tips and tutorials. Thanks for watching, and see you guys later!